You know, honestly, this is the first time that I've seen the title screen. <laughs> like, when I booted up the game, right, it was just like a blank open sea with nothing in it. But now that I've booted it up again, it's showing, um, you know, Ship Shape Island, and like it's tailing, it's tailing all those islands that I've collected, which is pretty neat. I also just find it really weird that the title screen music fades out. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, also, the game has an autosave feature. So, that's pretty nice. Also, um... Yeah, as you can see... My time for this game is very off, <laughs> because I looked at all the episodes, and I've done 12 episodes so far, and each of those are about two hours each. Which means, in actuality, I've only played the game 24 hours. 33 is, like, way off. Most of that is idle time, so the time on my save file is far from accurate. Oh, so I should probably sleep. Anyways, I got a new pair of headphones, and by new pair, I mean I replaced the pair that I had with the exact same brand. <laughs> They're literally the exact same, because, I, I don't know, I have an attachment issue. I get too attached to the shit that I have, and I don't want to try out new brands and stuff. Yeah, actually, that probably makes sense, but, yeah. So, I, um, got these headphones are like these red headphones I got them from the dollar store they're like 450 they're, it's not it's that it's not that expensive but they feel comfy enough um, they, they they go a decent length as well I mean they go enough length so that I can lay down and listen to shit while laying back in my bed and I can also have my mix amp on like the complete opposite end of the bed so yeah it's it's good enough for me. Anyways, today I think we should probably do some side quests before we go to Freezy Freeze Island, or whatever the hell it's called. So we need to go back to All Sand. Hey now, you're in All Sand. Get your game on. Go save a fucking toad. I'm curious as to when we're gonna get the, um... The ball speed ability, like the ball up speed, whatever, what are you gonna call it? The thing that makes our ball move faster. I don't know when we're gonna unlock that. Um, so there's a toad all the way on the opposite side of the frickin' island. That's fun. Anyways, since I've been playing Brother Shit for the past week now, I have not been working on Down Bad Edition. And I only now just started working on more of it today. And uh, I, I did like a very minor thing. I added a new enemy to the sewers. And I made Monstar a bit harder. <laughs> That's about all I can say I've done so far. Because there's a brand new spiny enemy in the sewers. Because Paper Mario 64 is kind of weird. Because... It throws a bunch of enemies from throughout the game into the sewers, like Fuzzy Beetles, Spinies, and Spike Tops. And so I decided to repurpose one of those Spinies and make it a slightly harder enemy. And I'm gonna give it a unique move as well that the other Spinies don't have. And apparently I can't have nice things because I get ambushed by frickin' Sunfish or Showerfish. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen the frickin' sunfish- I can't only get sunfish. I don't think I've ever seen the showerfish actually attack like that. It always, like, does its makeup and whatnot. But yeah, um, besides adding that new spiny enemy, I haven't really done too much. Like, I got- I got the Ultra Boots, and I'm about to enter Shiver City. 
which means I'm officially in the end game of Down Bad Edition. Because now I'm working on um, now I'm working on Chapter Seven, which is awesome. But that brings a new problem entirely. I have to. Um, okay, so obviously nobody's gonna really know this unless you watch every stream I do, but. Um, the Junior Troopa fights. I did- I added a little too much to the Junior Troopa fights. That, um, there's a memory overflow. And so, from the fourth Junior Troopa fight onwards, I have to, um, move them to a brand new battle section. Which is, uh, which means I have to port over the data to a completely different, um, like, file, I guess you could say. Yeah. Also, I think a lot of the shark bones kind of pissed off. Well, hang on. How do I get up there? Hey, look at... Is that a mushroom up there? A mushroom that grows here? Must be a new species. I'd like to get a closer look, but I wonder how you get over there. Maybe it'd be possible if you try from that direction. Yeah, but how the fuck... I don't know how to fucking get up there, because I can't... My ball ability can't go up that high. Are you serious, bro? I have to come back with that frickin' ability? Well, you know what? We fight- we, we find the shark bones today. They actually take damage now. Yeah, I wanna see if I can fucking beat these things now. I'll be one of the first people to beat the shark bone in this game. It's like a super enemy. Well, in order to survive, I have to not die. <laughs> That's the thing. Oh, never mind. I only did two damage. Okay, I'm learning how that attack works. Well, hang on a second. Um, there's a few things I want to do here. Uh, well, let's just set some battle plugs first. Remove this. Do I have the syrup one still? Yeah, I still can't- I still can't figure out how to get that to fucking work, by the way. Um, damage shield, I don't know if that's even gonna happen. Or if that's even gonna matter. Sure, we'll throw that on. Let's see, let's see how this does. Okay, yeah, I guess we're not doing as much damage as I thought. How about I just fight these guys until I die then? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Guess we're not being those guys. Well, hey, you know what? The great thing is now I don't have to go. I don't have to deal with that. So now I know I don't have to freaking deal with that stupid side quest. So I have to come back to it later whenever I get that bowl ability. Hey man, not my fault the toad somehow got stuck up there. He'll have to figure that out for his own. Anyways, let's go to uh, Rainforest Island, because that sounds a lot more fun than dealing with frickin' toads. And going to the frickin' All Sand Island for the millionth time. Anyways, I bought, um... I'm, I try, I'm trying out a new pastry today. I tried something called an, a Hello Dolly Bar, <laughs> which is a very weird name, by the way. But essentially, it's like, it's like, a, it has like peanut butter on the bottom, and I don't even know what the topping is, and then it's coated with coconut, chocolate chips, and peanut butter chips. 
which is pretty good. I, uh, I tried it out, I thought it was good. I threw it in the oven for a little bit and it came out nice and, like, sweet. And, uh, yeah, I really recommend it. You know, I'm kind of curious what will even pop up on Google if I search up Hello Dolly. <laughs> um, Hello Dolly squares. Um... Hello Dolly bars are made with graham cracker crust, pecans, coconut, chocolate, and butterscotch chips, and then drizzled with sweet condensed milk and baked. Hmm. Is it not peanut butter then? Is it's actually butterscotch? It tastes like peanut butter to me though, so I'm actually not sure now. Either way, it tasted good, so I don't really care. Oh, I forgot to sleep at the inn. I didn't save after I did that. Interesting, you've already taken down one. Monsters, such creatures offer endless possibilities. Welcome to the world of extreme battles. I'm Maniac number two in the Monster Maniac Club. We Maniacs love monsters and our monsters love us. Our club spends its days researching monsters and their habitats. Even within one monster species. Okay, I think we. I probably. I could probably. I could probably skip this, right? <laughs> Damage recovery. They've just snacked on syrup jars like good little beasts too. I may in fact have given them too much. They might even feel not even feel the hurt of battle now. Hmm. I'm worried they'll get out of control if they break free. Mind taking them down before they escape and go on a rampage? I'll have a special reward for you if you can do it. I'll warn you, that's a pretty big if. So think you can floor my nearly invisible hydro seedles? Well, can you? Alright, let's give it a try. We got extreme hydro seedle. If you feel out of your depth, you can always flee the battle. Hydro seedle R. <laughs> I mean, these enemies. I mean, they're gonna be easy to. Um... Okay, they're they're kind of slow. I was gonna say they they seem pretty simple to beat. Bro, why are they so fucking slow? No, they're just regular hydro seedles. Okay. So let me guess, the gimmick is gonna be they heal like, you know, a thousand HP or something when I attack them. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I could just do 484 damage with a lucky. Yep, I <laughs> fucking knew it, bro. I freaking knew they'd do that shit. So, the only way to do this battle, maybe, would be to, I don't know, just uh, exploit the shit out of them. Here's the problem, though. They're gonna keep healing themselves. Boom. Hmm. I am gonna need to find a way to stop them from healing, then. Dizzying could work. Bros boost probably would help too. Let's see. Boom. Now that didn't dizzy it. That might be what I need to do. I might need to dizzy it or something.
Well, it's gonna be a problem if they keep, uh, healing themselves. Boom. <laughs> I got another Lucky, though. Look at that. I'm gonna see if I can find cheese. Because otherwise, um... I don't know. Ooh. These guys don't want to become dizzy, I guess. Well, these guys are immune to being dizzy. Boom. Yeet. Wait, they're not healing now. Huh? <laughs> well, okay. Let's just get rid of this one, then. Okay, well, that, that helps. Alright, here's a bros boost. Oh my god, that is some amazing damage. Woo! How much did that do in total? 365. Oh no, they still got they still got some heals left in them. Also, Mario's out of BP. That kinda sucks. Do I have this the auto syrup thing? Well now I can put on the auto syrup thing. Let's see how much the jump helmet will do. That might be how we um break the 1000 damage cap later in the game. <laughs> Not, not as impressive as it could not as impressive as it could have been. And there goes all my hard work. <laughs> huh. Wait a minute. I just thought of something. Does this Does this only does do you have to specifically have regular syrup jars for that to kick in? Is that why it's not working? That if that if that's the case, that is so fucking dumb, bro. Well, clearly I can do this then. Oh yeah. I still have the dizzying thing on, so. See if maybe I can do it. They kind of give up on healing after a while. Like, I was able to kill one of them without them bothering to heal. Yeah. Yeah, this one isn't healing now. Hey, if Louis can get a crit here, that'd be sick. Yeah. 500. That's a bit better. I think the I think the amount of damage you do is based on if you get the center of the the spring or not. Okay. I should probably should I take off the bros boost or should I put on the performance bonus? Probably should. Alright, we can do we can do bomb derby to finish off the fight. Very unnecessary, but whatever. <laughs> Ooh. 
Boom. That easily probably did like a thousand damage, but we'll never know. Punch that sucker. <laughs> always, rem always remember to punch that sucker, guys. Incredible, honestly, I didn't think you'd be able to defeat them. Here's the reward I promised, please take it. Yippee! Yeah. Goodbye and thank you. Ah, uh, my dear little hydro seedles. Stash beans. Well, time for me to be off. I must find a stronger monster. Alright, well, that was fun. Let's, uh... <laughs> I guess we'll give one stash to each of the bros. So the only other one is Guardian Spirit. A young security guard is trying to l live up to his older brother's rep, but his overzealous approach is making life harder for his island's residents. On Bullfish. Oh yeah, I also showed my girlfriend this game today. And, uh, she, she, she enjoyed me trying to freaking explain the game more than she actually enjoyed the game. Because <laughs> so I was trying to explain it in my own little way. Come on, I said the thing that I've been saying this whole game. I, I love the battle plug system. I think it's very fun. Well, I didn't get to play this game at all before today, so... Yeah. Well, here's the assistant. Yum, I want to taste bullfish meals. Oh, Mario Luigi. You know, since the connectors started flowing again, our bullfish are very healthy. The bullfish dishes at the anglerfish restaurant are super tasty and selling well. I have to admit, I might have been overdoing it with all the meals I was eating there, but... Do you remember the security guard's younger brother? Well, he got himself a security job at the anglerfish restaurant. But well, he takes it too seriously. No one can get into the restaurant now. We're all dreaming about our favorite bullfish dishes and we can't get them. Mario, Luigi, I beg of you, please figure out how to get past that security guard. Alright, well, I guess we'll do that then. Unfortunately, violence isn't the answer to everything, so I can't just go up and smack the shit out of him. Please leave! Thanks for coming, but you're not allowed in. Why? Because of justice, that's why. This restaurant has really helped me, so I'm keeping all the weirdos out. I pay my debts, because that's what justice means to me. Everyone's upset because I can't have the t tasty bullfish dishes? Too bad. I don't care if they're island residents or outsiders. If I don't like- if I don't feel like I can trust them, they're not getting in. That ain't justice. What about the restaurant workers? What do you mean? Restaurant workers want people in- No! My idea of justice is the right one. Yeah, get him. Gr grill him, Snoutlet. If I don't trust someone, they're not getting in. That's what's best for the restaurant. Ugh, win me over. Gain my trust. Pass my quiz. Oh no, another quiz. What shape is Layne's favorite pillow? What? <laughs> what book is in the assistant's office? What dish is this restaurant known for? Um, I should probably go ask that. <laughs> Either that or I could guess blindly, but that's a bit, that's a less, bit less fun. Uh, the restaurant's serious dish? Well, I really like their bullfish teriyaki. If I could never eat it again, I'd be sad. Is that it, bullfish teriyaki? You've been admirable and clear, clear up the incident, gentlemen. Bravo! And a father and son must find some peace. Thank you, my fine mustached brothers. Well, where is his bed? Is his bed up here? Where 
is it? My job guarding the passage of the lighthouse is over. Now there's nothing to do but clean. It's not easy. Layden gets his snack crumbs everywhere. He's a real sloppy smacker. Where's his bed? Is that, is that his bed? It's like, uh, it's like a, it's like the shape of a shrimp or something. You know, I gotta go all the way into the frickin', his frickin' office. Actually, wait, his office isn't that far away. <laughs> the bathroom isn't that far away. I mean, as long as I don't have to fight the frickin' enemies again, I'll be fine. I'm doing this the legit way, instead of the guessy way. Anyways, it's honestly a big pleasure waking up every morning and finding new Brothership mods. Or not Brothership, um... Mar Party Jamboree mods. I keep getting Jamboree and Brothership mixed up. I don't know why. <laughs> I really don't. Uh, let's see. Island development and you, a leader's role. What can I do as an island's leader? To make life a little more fun for everyone else here. In this book, I'll discuss island leadership, including strategies for weathering tough times. What does leadership mean? <laughs> Sweets and treats, the world's best desserts. An authoritative guide to delectable dishes. Turn the page to tantalize your taste buds. Chapter 1, delicious desserts. For cakes, look no further than the bustling metropolis on Lotta Coins Island. However, the famed snow coat butter, the lights of slip and glide are culinary masterpieces. Yeah, I do I do remember that. Well, there's this book. Read the Assistant's Diary? No, not again. Hmm. I, I guess we'll have a look. I love the, I love this jazzy underground music. And you know, it's, it's refreshing not hearing the underground theme remixed for the millionth time. As good as that is, as good as it is to hear the underground song over and over, I, prefer, I, I like it when we have, like, different underground themes. A good example is Mysteries of the Cave from Dream Team. Or, um, Bowser Road from Bowser's Inside Story. Those are, like, really good examples of, like, good underground songs. And I think, uh, those are the only two games with unique underground themes, because Partisan Time has an underground remix, Superstar Saga does, and Paper Jam does. Alright, well, let's see if I got this or not. What shape is Layton's favorite pillow? Yeah, that's a shrimp. What book is in the assistant's office? Um, Island Development and You. And then, uh, bold, <laughs> bold Fish Pizza. Let's see if I got it. You got them all correct? I, I lost. There's no way anyone here should have been able to pass my ridiculously difficult challenge. I'm a failure. My future is one of the eternal shame. I, I'm completely defeated. And deflated. We need a new word from it. I'm defleted. Look, you're so focused on winning and losing, but you're forgetting the most important thing. The most important thing? The food. Having everyone taste and enjoy the yummy food the restaurant serves up. That's what a restaurant's all about, you know? Oh, you're right. I was so caught up in my personal definition of justice. I wasn't thinking about what was right for the restaurant. Sounds like you get it now through, right? You get it now, though, right? Thanks to you, I've been- I've seen my mistakes. Here, I need to give you something. Oh, yeah. Yes! Please enjoy the tasty bullfish dishes. Yeah, I'm gonna try everything on the menu. Welcome. Alright, well, I think that's it then for now, because we can't do the toad one. It's nice that they give you, like, two or three side quests when you're done, like, with an island. But anyways, now that I have my headphones, I'm ready to do an all-nighter with Brothership, so... I might even be able to do two episodes in one session, because I only did one episode in the last session. 
Even though it was a slightly longer session, I believe. Anyways, let's sleep at the end. Yep, free BP restoration. Do I need to buy more syrups, by the way? I might buy a few, just because. Even though I'm broke. <laughs> I'm kind of broke, so I need to be careful. Well, what can we sell? Hmm. Well, can't sell any of this crap, that's for sure. I mean, I could sell my- I could sell a few of my super nuts. I only have one candy. I'll make everybody a bit of cash I can. Do you have a request? Nope. Um, it kind of looks like he has the same shit as before. Um, yeah, I think it's the same stuff. Also, hang on, the POW gloves, they give Mario the same amount of s They give him the same amount of shit with the gold POW gloves. Hmm. Alright, so... We should go to the next island. But thankfully, it's, uh, like... It's right up here. It'd be pretty easy to reach. So I gotta get out of this dang current first. That's a bit of a problem. Yeah, we're gonna go to Slip and Glide next, which is the next island in the game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's it, right there. Oh, oh! The only way I'm able to keep myself sane is to do Mario and Luigi impressions all the time. And make them say dumb shit. And Luigi ate shit again. <laughs> okay. Oh boy, this frickin' music. It just reminds me of the ice puzzle. <laughs> Yeah! It's so cold! What in the world? It just crash landed! Oh, I thought I saw some weird lumpy stuff crash down over here. Wait, are you guys the weird lumpy stuff? You're connecting islands? There you go, telling jokes again. Huh? You're not joking? You're actually serious? No one can reconnect Concordia, can they? Listen, we're on Slip and Glide, yeah? Yep, this is indeed Slip and Glide Island. A land perpetually covered in snow. In other words, it's Canada. It's no doubt about it. <laughs> right, can we get out of here, like, before someone mistakes me for a wad of cold cuts? Going by that call we got before, Looks like Idol found the extension core. We better get him quick. Just so you know, they're gonna cause another ruckus. Oh, hey, it's a good thing Mario's got all that fat on him. That's gonna keep him warm for a while. Here, this way. Oh shit, it's Joseph! I shot the Goombush in this area, dude! Alright, we better find him quick. You guys go that way. I'll search this way. Yes, yeah, sure. Joseph mentioned... <laughs> Flying Joseph! <laughs> it's just Joseph with wings! <laughs> I know, right? It's pretty cool. This is Slip and Glide Island, where snow falls year-round. Usually we have a whopping wonderful time, despite the cold, but lately... We've got a lot of folks running off of the mouth saying kooky stuff. Kooky, like the kooky kooky. 
There were some mighty rumblings when the island separated. It caused an avalanche. Snow shoveling duty's no joke either, especially with so few people to help. All those folks mumbling and staring at the wall barely turn around and never offer to help. This island's so cold all year round, from sun up to sun down. But isn't that crisp air delicious? Just don't breathe it in too hard, you'll catch a cold. Even the blocks have snow on them. Hold up. Well, well, look, customers from another island, please, please peruse our wares. Um, singular boots, whittle down hammer. Um, I, I mean, I should get the repel wear at some point. But uh, I'm gonna need a bunch of money for that. Dude, I'm already broke for the rest of the game at this point. <laughs> I can't handle it, dude. I'm so broke. Alright. Okay, so now we can make the, that new plug that I wanted. Um, where was it? The speedy recharge, yeah. It's like frickin' plugception over here, man. So what I can do is just throw that on. <laughs> Boom. So that applies for the next five plugs. Jillian alone, this is the best. Jesus Christ, there's so many Gloom citizens. There's a cake maker along this road. I've been there to buy cakes for people myself. Mind you, there's no way of getting there with these flowers all closed up, but who cares? If I buy any cakes from now on, they'll be for me and me only. Well, if I'm crying, it's because I'm happy that they don't want to bother me with friendship. That's a big load of ice cream, no doubt. Bet you'd bust a gut eating it all by yourself. Still, no way I'm split it with someone else. Better a busted gut than, ugh, sharing. You folks came from another island, did you? Couldn't you just come a bit, a bit sooner? Slipping Glass Island is a cold place for sure, but the folks here have warm hearts. Or they used to, anyhow. Lately, they're as cold as ice, like their hearts froze up or something. Prince Chili, I'm running off with some princess. What a doofus. Why'd you ever want to get attached to someone else? Mom's constantly nagging me to make some friends. Why do I need friends? Oh, I can go inside the building! Just ignore me. Who are you? Be gone! Damn, even the Elder is cursed? Hey, we're looking for some suspicious folks in some kind of building. You're the suspicious ones. And I'm the chief, so get lost. You're the island's chief? Chilean's pop by any chance? I have no son, much less a son named Chilean. Off with you. Oh shit. Everyone's infected with gloom. We're not gonna get any answers. Mario, Mario look, another gloom guy. Oh. Finally, the only normal person on this island. No, please, let me go. Don't get me with that zappy thing. Oh, so you're the ones who'll take care of those oddballs. I'm sorry about my behavior. I shouldn't have been so pig-headed. Why do you have to look at me when you say that? <laughs> ah, forget it. Tell us more about that zappy things. I saw it. There was this funny machine. It zapped all my buds. The ones who got zapped started acting all angry and irritable. I got scared, so I just kind of hid myself from all the action. While that weirdo was gone, I went to spy on their hideout. I only saw the outside, but it seems like a top secret research facility. It's just on the other side of this lake. Thanks, pals. We got another excuse to use our ball ability, too. How fun. Boom. Give up. 
Give me all the money. Yeah, that was worth it. Oh, customers from another island. Please tell you what we have to offer. Yeah, you know, your typical items and stuff. I mean, really, you don't technically need items ever, but they're there. Red eye little snow rabbit looks happy all alone. It's like a snow bunny. Yeah. Super syrup. That was a really easy one to spot, too. Ah, uh, the connector flower is not blooming again today. Oh, I hope it stays like that, all tightly closed up, just like my feelings. Man, I gotta stop yawning so much. Oh, I see how these work. Here, why don't we die? <laughs> here, why don't we die? Let's go down here. I'm curious, but what's down here? Thunder coins. Well, I, I see some... Some luminite here. Luminite? <laughs> no, this, this isn't, this isn't Terraria. Oh, shit! Okay, maybe I should have gone up then. Uh, it's kind of confusing on where I should go. There's a lot of different pathways. Ultra candy. See, now that's a good item. Oh, shit! So what does this island look like? Ooh, it's gonna be a pretty long one. There's a cave section, it looks like. I mean, the cave in the lava one was pretty fun, though, so I don't mind. We got a one-up. Yeah. What do we have over here? All those drill guys from the desert world. They're back. But now they're icy. Yo, what's Fishy Boopkins? What the hell is Fishy Boopkins doing here? Got him. Yo, Fishy Boopkins is here. Drill BR. Yeah, and they're snowy this time. Oh yeah, right, I still have Bros Boost on. Boom. Wow, Fishy Boopkins is dead. Yay, I got Coin Collector, finally. And that plug's gone. Rip. Well, the fun all lasted, I guess. That is a pretty satisfying noise. Boom. Yeah, performance bonus is gonna help, though. <laughs> Luigi! Alright. Let's see, uh... Okay, let's check out the challenges. So... Three left. Seven left. Seventy-three luckies left. Um... Oh, we're three quarters of the way done that challenge. Collect 50,000 coins in battle. Oh my god. But we do get the golden stash gloves for doing that. That's. This one is gonna take a while to get all that moon knee. This reminds me of the dick measuring contest in Paper Jam. <laughs> if you guys didn't know. We had a little, like, kind of contest it, when me and the boys played Paper Jam. And we tried to figure out who gets- who's gonna get the Coin King achievement first. <laughs> and I think it ended up being Seb, so... 
nice to see that back. <laughs> so, again, these will, these will come as they happen. I'm getting really close to getting that thousand damage achievement, though. But oh, man, besides the do-it-yourself achievement, we can definitely get most of these done. Alright, so I'm kind of curious what I missed up here. There's a lot here, bro. I can't believe Fishy Boopkins made it to frickin' Brothership, guys. Good for him, you know? Oh shit. I lost my rhythm, bro. What am I doing? Eh, it's fine. Dang, I didn't- since when did the jump helmet become the burp helmet? Level 400 damage is just the norm now. Oh, they got the frickin' spike wheels from 3D World. Oh, that is weird. Oh, that is really weird. I don't know how to dodge that. Yeah. Boom. See, that, that's at 386, not 400. So weird. Mario's at level 26! Yes! Alright, so... We're getting closer to Leaf Rank. Three more to go. Luigi will probably, um get it soon. Maybe in the next episode or something. I don't know. Oh, wait. I want to get those, dude. Oh, shit! Is that another glow enemy? Alright. We're getting the hang of things. Gloom, I said. It's interesting how they introduce the, like, Isad and Magmad enemies. And then immediately in the next air in the next two areas that are also lava and ice theme, by the way, they introduce Gloom versions of them. Alright, yeah, that's not too bad to do, honestly. Boom. That did jack shit! Boom. That also did jack shit. Oh, he just pissed off. Man, I really should have used the bomb derby then. Jesus. <laughs> Waste of time not to if they're gonna run away. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, I can redeem myself now. Bruh. Oh no, the, the frickin' ice status. Oh shit. Dang, Luigi ain't doing too good now. Oh, I got a candy. You know what? Fuck it. Use the Ultra Candy. We might as well. Plug recharged. Which ones do we got now? Why is there only one for the fiery attack? Um, oh, performance bonus is back now. Yeah. 
you think it would do critical damage, but it doesn't. Damn, that was like three crits. That's an easy way to get crits, then. What the fuck is happening, bro? <laughs> I'm so lost. Oh, yeah! I'm actually wondering if you can use the jump helmet to jump on spiky enemies. There, there's just two more free crits. Three crits! Five. Dude, I just got like five crits at once. Man, Bomber is gonna make it really easy to get that lucky, that lucky achievement. At this point, at this point, I should check how much I have now. I keep forgetting it's challenges, not side quests. I have 65 to go now. We're almost there. Um. Fishy Boopkins. You know what? Let's just let's just do oh, yeah. get this plug out. Yeah. That's something that that's something you gotta be mindful of. Is Shit does not recharge if you throw it out. So you should probably use all of, um... You should probably use all of it. Is what I'm trying to say. Like, don't, don't, like, don't, like, take it off when you have, like, half left or whatever. Like, or, like, if you have, like, two or three uses out left, you might as well just use the rest of them. Also, yeah, these guys dropping money every time I hit them? That is actually amazing. Yeah, Bomb Derby Expert. Speed Bean Power Bean. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, look how close Luigi is to leveling up now. Okay. I'll use up my mushroom. Also, is that Ello? Ello's just chilling here? Uh, I was waiting for you guys. The lab, it's close. Sign, sign, sign. What do you want to tell me, sign? Secret research lab of ten. Extension cores, handsome, insightful, brilliant, humble genius. Huh. Oh, come on! It says secret research lab right there! A big sign's not secret. Might as well light up the lab with a spotlight. Looks a lot like that dorky dude's noggin. See, that's kind of funny. Maybe he's more of a comedic genius than a lab genius. Hey, knock it off! Help me! <laughs> no escape for you! Hey! You were just trying to buy some time until the Stash Brothers showed up! Yeah, that's right! Mario and Luigi, get him! Smooth save, kid! So yeah, let's go, Plughead! Get grounded or get pounded! <laughs> <laughs> What's so fucking funny, huh? <laughs> Stylish tactical retreat. Lol. Hey, come back. What a weedo. He's making a break from the top of the mountain. After him. Can I am I allowed to go in the lab? I'm fine. Just go get that jerk. I'll guard this spot. 
What? I ain't scared. I'm flexing my mean mug. All right, that is mean rug. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, let's make another save then, since... Mario's a level 26. Hey, yeah, bitch. We can check out the lab facility later. We need to get 10. Let's go. Fine. Ooh. Hit him for a lot. Oh, it's not gonna get it's not gonna be easy to get up there though, huh? That wind's awful. I got it. Oh here it is it's time. Oh yeah, guess the ball doesn't get as much wind resistance, does it? Almost. Oh, looks promising. What's wrong? You can roll better with more force? Think you can make it happen? Yeah! Hold X to accelerate. Press X to launch. Woo! Boom! Yeah, now we become Sonic! Amazing! Oh, yeah! Great job, both of yous! You learn ball blitz! Finally, <laughs> I can do that damn toad quest now. This bros move can only be used while you're transformed to a bro ball. Charge up power to accelerate quickly. Actually, wait, you know what this is? No, this is not really... It's not really the spin dash, it's more of the ball boost from Prime. From Metroid Prime. Hold X to charge up. Once you're charged up, release X to zoom forward with zoom zyke. Hit enemies while dashing to start a battle. Oh, you can do that too, that's cool. Oh, I see. Rumor has it that sugared powder falls around these parts. And that extra special snow is a wonderful ingredient for chocolate. Only, I've been searching this area for about a week with now with no luck. Hey, I mean, well, as long as you're not- as long as you're not using it to make munchlies or something. Oh, that's hella fun. Gotcha! <laughs> yes, I'm impressed that you found my secret lab. But you're wasting your time. Why? Well, let me tell you about my research. It's- it yielded absolutely nothing! So, complete failure, then. Of course, I can't get anything done when Master Zocket holds all the gloom power. All I get is whatever a tiny little portion I'm able to beg, borrow, or steal. Sad. But someday, I'll be the master. I'll be the shadowy genius pulling the strings. What a wonderful life I shall lead, then. <laughs> One can dream. Enough of you. How do I fix it? You fool! I have the foggiest idea! Socket's an enigma. I don't even know his true goal. Boss doesn't even trust you, eh? Wait. Wait? Wait for what? Hey, look over there! <laughs> Drat, you were supposed to keep looking! Wow, it's a long way down. Can he fly or something? Ooh, uh, that was scarier than I thought it'd be. Anyway, next time we meet, it'll be the end of the Stash Bros. And there he goes. What is that guy's deal? He's a piece of poop, I tell ya. Check out his lab. Didn't he say that his research was a complete failure? Good point. Can't really trust a wacky dude like that. To the lab. 
Thankfully, they're kind enough to warp me back here. I didn't miss any, uh... I didn't miss anything, did I? Okay, good. Um... We get these blocks. Hey, I was getting blocks, bro! Also, look at the little penguin in the background. You guys see that penguin down there? You see that penguin? He's a cute penguin. Now Nico has to play this game. He'll no he'll notice that penguin immediately. <laughs> Actually, that is a good question. I'm not sure if Nico Nico B is playing this game or not. I guess I'll find out. Wow, it totally looks like an evil villain lab, doesn't it? With all the purple and shit. Wow, he's self-portrait. Personally, I'd be too embarrassed to hang it. Lol. Wow. Notes on Master Zaki. The Master's past is wrapped in mystery, and he hasn't let me in on the point of, the, of his plan. He's a stick, stickler for details, and yet he can never get my name right. Drives me nuts. But for the sake of my future career, I'll just smile and nod when he talks. Bro's really just following along with whatever he says. Oh, wait. There's a secret back here. Oh, slow down, boots. What do those do? Lowers damage enemy speed by 30%. Okay, then, yeah, definitely something for Luigi. <laughs> Mario could use a better hammer, honestly. Hey, that was a good find, though. I'm glad I found those. I'm, I'm curious if anybody's found that. Well, I guess we'll find out. What the fuck is this thing? What's this thing? Enough already. Let's move on. There's actually not all that much to examine here, even though it looks like there's a lot of shit here. Can I not go in there? Hmm. Where else can I go? Hmm. Oh, wait, maybe these books right here? Notes on my amazing research. Spite bulbs have a dark, a kind of dark energy. When the energy is amplified and allowed to ripen, gloam can be extracted from it. Subjects exposed to gloam seem to wait, want, and withdraw from most social contact. I don't yet have an explanation for this, but the results of the research are awesome. Hmm. Is, is that it? Is that all they wanted me to do here? I mean, I looked at it, so that's cool. Reach the lighthouse. What kind of lab is that? It's just a bunch of junk. Mario Luigi, how's it going? Hi, Princess Peach. It's me, Luke. I'm taking care of Mario and Luigi. You and the others are safe and sound, Luke? Wonderful. I see. The research lab was a dead end. Well, thank you for trying. Can you try to make it back to Ship Shape Island now? No! Do take care. Irene and I are watching over the prince and princess. <laughs> yeah, we gotta go do- we gotta go connect the island first, bro. You guys got on a lengthy lighthouse to the island, right? Better be careful. Oh, yeah. Yes! Get a good view of everything. Can't see him, dude. Hey, hey, you. You find him yet? Afraid not, boss. Hey, up. I'm getting hungry. Yes, sir. I guess we're gonna go fight the Josephs at some point. Alright, is this Grampy turnip? Yes! I'm Sipping Glide Island's Grampy Turnip. The wild way you pulled me out was epic. So what are you all up to? 
You're not ditching your work just to bust out old Grampy Turnip, are you? Or maybe you're taking a break, a breakout break, to break me out of the dirt. Heh, <laughs> you really put the break in break out, don't you? I like saying break. Well, there's nothing wrong with that. It's important to get some rest, after all. Do you want to hear what Grampy Turnip recommends on the break? Do ya? Do ya? I recommend tidying up. Whether well, it's your whole desk or even one drawer. Tidying's the way to go. I recommend it because it'll make you feel lighter, like your mind itself's been tidy. You better take note of what this slipping guy at Island Grampy Turnip told you. Now, I've got one more thing to say. What do taking breaks and going on diets have in common? The answer is... You gotta be careful not to do too much of either one. Heard that one already? Sorry. Alright, well, I add that to my Grampy Turnip compilation. I don't know why I said compilation. Get up here. Hey. Fuck! T well, first time we saw that animation. Ooh, I love the coin plier, dude. It's so nice. Although, chances are, it's probably gonna run out very quickly. <laughs> I guess that's the only problem, huh? You know what? Kaboom attack. Kaboom attack. You can never go wrong with Kaboom attack. Alright, you know what? I need to find out something. Can I jump on these guys with the jump helmet? Now, I know that might sound like a stupid question, but I need to know. Because, here's the thing, right? Luigi makes a little drill, so maybe he'll be able to land on them. Yes, he can! That's- that actually makes ju that jump helmet more broken. Because if I remember correctly, the jump helmet in the original cannot jump on spiky enemies. So they actually buffed that, then. Alright, here we go. Boom. Oh, I think the coin plier applies to all of those hits. I don't think it depletes either from my, uh, my coin plier, um, oh, yeah. like, usage. That's pretty dope. Okay, so we got a flower here. And three hidden blocks. Whoops! <laughs> Alright, what we got up here? I can't even use this flower, bro. Alright, so I think we gotta use our new ability here. Boom. Also, how do I get that? No! I love the stock sound effect that it makes. I'm a sucker for stock sound effects in games sometimes. I don't know why. Four. We got a, uh, we got a dangerous one here. Shake. Man, I'm eating shit today. Yeah, I just had to get a feel for that. Yeah, I still have 14 uses of that. Man, the coin player one's actually really good, then. Man, I'm gonna get my money back in no time with this. I wonder if there's gonna be an experience one later. That'd be pretty sick. Counter! Bruh. Why can't I guard that shit, man? <laughs> Gloam dust? That's a new one.
All right, we need healing stat. All right, let's use some syrups then. There we go. And we got some nuts. Oh yeah, let's use those beans that we got. All right, you know, Luigi, you can have some power. And give all the speed to Luigi. Give two stash to Mara and one stash to Luigi. <laughs> We're getting closer to the next level up. So Luigi's like a full 3,500 experience ahead. That's pretty great. Okay, so three more jump helmets, and then we have that one done. Dark fishy boopkins. I don't know how you're supposed to tell which way it's supposed to go, but whatever. Thanks, so even Bowser's minions are getting infected by that. Well, you saw it with the plant gang in the last zone. Alright, let's get this guy out of here. I can't wait till someone, um, data mines all the stats for the enemies in this game, and then we'll have that updated on the Mario wiki. <laughs> That'll be nice. Boom! More Gloom Dust. Again, I don't know how you're supposed to know which way that thing goes. Boom. We're getting a decent amount of coins from these battles. Oh man, I'm getting my ass kicked. How much money do I have now? 2k! Look at that, I already got a lot. Man, I can't first strike for shit in this game. The enemies are so damn fast. It's interesting, because the glow enemies also sometimes just outright skip their turn. Which is very weird. Other times they counter you, so... It kinda all balances out, doesn't it? Holy shit. 583. Oh. There's, hey, there's another lucky, by the way. <laughs> Got him. Yeah, with the death reception, it's still a little hard to avoid, honestly. But I got the hang of it. Boom. The Kaboom attack came in handy there. Yes! Alright, two more levels, boys. We're almost there to leaf rank. Ah, oh, so exciting, because 
I, I've never, again, since I'm playing this blind, and I, I have not, there's no information on this game yet, it, it's exciting that I'm finding out for myself, like, what the new shit is. Oh, hey, look, it's those ice blocks from the puzzle. Alright, here's the cave. Ugh, so cold. Let's see, the exit is... It, it's some ways... Over there. Okay, let's get out of here. Well, immediately, let's push that block over. Are we gonna need to build a bridge or something? Huh? You made a path out of ice. Just a little bit more. Oh, yeah. I gotta listen to this cave music some more, so I got no complaints there. Oh yeah! Ooh, we get one of these again. I love these puzzles. They're so fun. Wait, hang on. I don't want this money. Shit, I gotta go back up. Shit, I gotta go back up. Boom. Well, I mean, I know how these these things work. So, let's go. Um, okay. So, this goes over here. Ooh, Pepe Coins! It's ultra Net! Um, okay, now what? Do I need to push this up or down? I guess over here, right? Hmm. Now the hard question is, do I push it this way? Um... I mean, that seems about right. Also, that looks like a grade I can use the, um, the thing on. Wait, now I'm just back here again. And what happens if you push this on the spikes? It dies, okay. So don't do it that way, then. <laughs> Obviously. Oh, and I can't push it, though. So I guess going down was the correct option after all. Okay, obviously right's not an option. We could try pushing it down this time. Boom. Up, and then uh, to the right. And then up again. And to the left. And then, um... I don't think pushing it down is going to help at all. Up. Left. Uh, up again, I think? Oh wait, it's stuck. Okay. Down. Left won't work. I don't know, man. It is getting confusing. <laughs> I'm also just confused in general what I need to do here. Like, what does it want? Hmm. I don't know. I feel like I need to push this somewhere. I feel like I need to... 
Well, we could try right there, maybe. This is confusing, bro. Oh, am I supposed to get it to where that grate is, or what? That's what I'm not sure about. Like, what is my goal with these? Am I supposed to... Can I jump on top of these? No. Hmm. Well, anyway, I see another thing over here. Actually, there's a lot of these weird grate things. Maybe I need to get it over there. Hey, yeah, when did these show up? I don't remember these being here. Oh, wait. It's moving. It's moving these grates. I'm noticing. Oh, okay. So what happens if I push this then? Oh, I see. And then I can... Then, then what? What do I do about that? Hang on, no, I got an idea. So I think what I'm supposed to do now... Is, um... Push this up here? Um, no, nah, that doesn't that doesn't help. I don't think. I think what I need to do then push that over here. Ooh, ah, uh, man, I'm trying. I'm so I'm trying so hard to figure this out. So I think what I need to actually do is push this up, push it down. Well, here's the problem. I can't push it. I can't push it to the left when I'm... Yeah, it won't let me... Wait, no, never mind. I don't know if I'm a if I was supposed to do that. But now I can push this over here. I can... I can't exactly jump up here, though. Is the problem. I'm questioning it. My, my question is, how the fuck do I get up there? <laughs> I don't know. And more importantly, is there any reason for me to um, do this puzzle? Because I don't see anything else for me to do here. Oh, there's probably something very easy, very simple that I'm missing here. I, I don't know. I don't see anything. There's nothing else up here. It just ends. And then I'm expected to somehow get up there? Well, that's what I don't get. What the fuck are you supposed to do here? Luigi! Can we can we use the propel can we use this ability? Oh yeah, see there's an archway, so you just you can't get over there. Well I can't we can't go we can do this though. Okay. So I can fly over here. Oh, but if you're playing with both bros, it breaks. <laughs> so that's probably why. Well, then I just gotta fly a bit further, then. No, well, okay, so when you're using both of them, they just fucking- it just fucking breaks, then. What the shit are you supposed to do here? 
Oh, wait, I'm so... I'm stupid, bro. I'm supposed to push it... I'm supposed to push it down here. Whoa. And that's the whole point of that being there. Okay, I see. I think we're supposed to come back here later. Okay, let me try that then. Okay, so you have to time it, and then you press it down. And then we can make a bridge. I, w I, was, I was going about that puzzle really wrong, bro. <laughs> okay, and then... Now we, now we can make progress. Okay, there we go. So that's how you do that puzzle. See? <laughs> they, they thought about that. You can't use the, um... You can't use the, the bros. Oh, shit. That platform has a mind of its own. Okay, so before I grab that ice block, I want what I want to do is I want to go over here and get this block. Get a HP bangle. Cool. And then I want to jump over here, get a free Ultra Shroom. Okay, so we gotta figure out how to get this thing out of here. Hmm. Well, we can push it left. Actually, this should be pretty easy. <laughs> I think I actually. Okay, maybe it's not as easy as I thought. Fuck. Never mind. I guess you can't do that then. <laughs> Okay, what if we put- okay, we can't push it to the right, either. So what am I supposed to do? Push it up? No, you can't do it upwards, either. That's probably the point of that. So that you can push it down here. And then you push it right. And then you push it up. And then you do the same shit you were doing earlier. There you go. Thankfully, they move slow enough that you can do it. Luigi! Mario! Luigi! Let's go! Luigi, hurry up! <laughs> that puzzle took me way longer than it should have, honestly. <laughs> but it was a good puzzle. It was a Silent Hill puzzle. Ooh, heart block. I greatly deserve that. Mm -mm -mm. What time am I at? Oh my god, an hour 28? Where is the time gone? Jesus. <laughs> yeah. I haven't even finished this island yet. But hey, on the bright side, we can go back to the frickin' All Sand Island now. Ooh, they added a sixth block now. Gold medallion, now that's worth it. That is very much worth it. Goombas! You're gonna turn into a Goomba! Ugh, so cold. Suck it up, some will come for us, I know it. But are we gonna be hard to spot all puddled like this? We get mistaken for a rock or something. Woo! Whoa! Huh? What's that? M Mario and Luigi? The Goombas, there they are, dude. 
Hey, Mario and Luigi are there too. We're coming to help. Bring the others over too. What are you doing here? Never mind that. Just get him. You've met your match. Let's get him. Goombas. We did it, guys. We met the Goombas. We got our Goomba quota for Mario and Luigi. First, you'll face the awesome might of the Goomba Talion. When one of us KO'd, another one steps up. Know why? Because we're extremely supportive. The only way I'll ever be is to somehow chaos all at once. Not <laughs> like that could ever happen. Oh, is this, is this the fucking, um... Is this the fucking Delete Trio? Oh, great. Elite Trio moment. Should I use the jump helmet? Sure, let's let's use the elite. Let's, let's use the jump helmet. We gotta get that. We gotta get that uh, that number up, you know. Boom. Hey, there it is. Worth it. I got what I wanted. Very expressive Goombas. Boom. Well, there, there, there's Ted dead Goom- There are two dead new Goombas right there. Oh, and they called even more Goombas. <laughs> oh shit, that's that's pretty great, honestly. All right, here we go. Boom. Dang! Absolutely wiped those guys. Well, yeah, it is a pretty good spot to grind money, I guess, right? <laughs> Boom. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, rip, they're out of charge now. Hang on, that gives me a good idea. Let's just th throw on my favorite ones. Um... You know what? Loot Booster. There we go. This will do with some good damage. Hey? Hey, oh, what the fuck? Did I mash too hard or something? Okay, there we go. Got him. How much did I get for that? Don't get cocky just because you beat the Goomba Talion. These guys are chumps. Now you're up against the Koopa Troopa Paratroopa Joint Task Force. That's a long name. Now try to surf on our wave attack. You'll definitely wipe it out. Alright. Bomb Derby then. Some decent damage there. Alright, Zap Raider again. Maybe we'll be able to kill him in one turn, who knows? Boom. Wow, they got smoked. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> yeah, I guess some pretty good some pretty good coins there. We didn't even get to see the Koopa's attacks. Hey, where'd everybody go? Oh, it's Blowjob Jr. 
I was wondering who that. I was wondering what that weird voice was. Uh, where are you? <laughs> I just want to round up the minions and get a thumbs up from Dad. No fair. <laughs> I'm hungry. Guess I better get back to the castle. And he has this clown car. Great. <laughs> Him. Luigi? Luigi, you see fucking blowjob junior? It's a goal. We got our first run in with Bowser Jr. there, I guess. Pretty neat. Alright, we can make some new plugs. Which ones though? Dang it, these all cost 60. I guess boomerang item's not a bad one to make. I could have made this one a lot easier, a lot earlier, oh. but whatever. Maybe, maybe this, maybe this one is worth making. I don't know. So, hmm, there's four of these. Three of these, and one of these. It's gonna take a while to get that last one. I'm kinda- I'm still really curious what that last, um, what- what these last ones are gonna be. And it looks like we missed a crap ton of, uh... Yeah, they're all right there. Oh, go figure. Alright, with that, we have finished another island. Let's go! That was really cool. It was like a Goomba Koopa mini boss. <laughs> you don't see those too often. I'm 25 hours in, guys, and it took it took me 25 hours to find a Goomba. This is the best Mario and Luigi ever. Yeah, let's free those bulbs. <laughs> I'm gonna tell that to the boys, and we're like, I did it, guys. It took me 25 hours to find a Goomba. <laughs> Alright, Slip and Glide Island's been added. Whoosh. The tree. I'm curious where we're going next. Are we going to the next, uh, are we going to the next, uh, lighthouse already? Welcome back, everyone. Come this way, hurry. Dr. Volko is ready to cure Prince Chilium. The Isle Gang's already here. Let's go. Those toads are still working hard. Trying to make the boat go faster when we really don't need to. <laughs> well, Doc, is he far too gone or what? Far from it. I have some medicine that's meant to be administered. Orally! Chew six times and swallow it all. <laughs> What happened? Chilium, are you my Chilium? What kind of medicine did you give him? A special fruit only found on Way Away Island and known as an amp berry. Someone gave me a couple as a souvenir a while ago. When a heart freezes over, this fruit can thaw it again from the inside out. Yeah, like Inside Out, the movie. Chilium, speak to me, my snowflake. Well, don't call him a snowflake. He's not sensitive, is he? I don't understand. What was I doing? Oh, Chilium! <laughs> Yay, he's all better. That's amazing, Dr. Volko. Our gloom problems are over. Right, you are. I wasn't certain that would do the trick, but unfortunately... Come again? 
Nothing. Pay no mind. I bet we'll see more patients. Good thing there's medicine enough for everyone. But what happened to put me in such a state? What? Gloom? It may sound strange, but it's true! But no worries, Mario and his friends have the problem licked. I never want to be apart. Let's stay together forever and ever. I would never leave you, Bernadette. <laughs> look, at, look at Irene's face. <laughs> He's like, <gasps> I'm sorry if I ever acted otherwise. Chilly. Bernie. There they go, shutting out the world again. It's nice that they made up, at least. It's time, my love. For our wedding! Celebration! Alrighty. So sudden. No, this is something we've talked about for a while. We intend to hold a grand ceremony on Heat Freeze Island. Our love will be cemented there for all the world to see. We'll bridge the two peoples so that we can be we can be at peace. Is that gonna work? Everyone on slip and glide island got hit with gloom. Leave that to me and my meds. There might be lots of patients, but I'll fix them up one at a time. <laughs> yeah, he can he can just force feed everybody until they feel better. We can get rid of the gloom and celebrate their love. Everybody's a winner. You are you are winner. It's perfect. The thing is, we haven't done any planning for this ceremony. If you have any ideas, we'd love to hear them. Mm. Oh, yes, that's very true. We must have a wedding cake. Well, why don't you get it from Lotta Coins? <laughs> and a flower crown for me, the burning bride. Good idea. Is there going to be a side quest for that? What else goes into a wedding? Hmm, maybe they should... Uh, wedding schmetting. Is there a way we could ruin this? I have a good idea. <laughs> Seriously? You came up with that one? I hate saying this, but it's actually a great idea. Fine, I'll let Shun lead this one. Let's see if you can pull it off, Shun. Ha 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 leave it to me. That's the first that's the first time in the game they didn't interrupt them. <laughs> Speaking of soggy cake, they do a good one on Slip and Glide Island. You use a white chocolate made from sugar powder called Snowco butter. You gotta taste it to believe it. <laughs> believe it. Our problem solved. Now, where do we get a nice flower crown? Well probably Four Owl Island, right? Perhaps one of the artists from the community on Floral Island. Oh, yeah. Yes. Is that is that gonna is that gonna be a side quest? Frostbitten toads. Well, um, I guess we're gonna do some side quests. What the fuck? Wow, real convincing there, buddy. Ahem, <laughs> you customer. You are holding a wedding? Could a humble merchant like myself help? Wow, word got out quick. Yes, we are. We need a cake and a flower crown. Know where we can get them? Oh, you're in luck. Here, take this strangely relevant flyer. Now I must go, for I am so busy. So, so busy. <laughs> Roll left. Alright, what we got here? If it's a cake you want, get yourself to Lot of Coins Island. A world-renowned chef creates the finest cakes in all the land. His masterpiece is satisfy even the pickiest Lot of Coins citizen. So you're guaranteed to be a hit at any party or wedding. Of course, no event is complete without a flower crown. For the finest in floral headwear, visit beautiful Rainforest Island. Why wear jewels when you can wear some flowery beauty? Make the bride's special day even more special with a flower crown. That's what he says anyway. A lot of coins and Rayforced. I wouldn't mind going back. Hmm. 
What, you think it's fishy? They are too good to be true? Uh, think about it some more, you might be right. I'd love to shop around, but we're on the clock. We can only order one cake and one flower crown. So, we should be sure of which one we're going for. Hey, Mario Luigi? I'm gonna go to the couple's hometowns. I feel like the parents should be at their kid's wedding. But the glum all over the islands might make that hard. I'm gonna go along too, so don't worry. Oh, we got another side quest. Check in on Connie and Ark. Some women are gathering secretly. What could they be disgusting? On Shitley, listen to the group discussion on Ship Shape. Did you know there are some girls who love a good debate apart from us, I mean? What could they be talking about? Whatever it is, how cute. Reminds me of not too long ago. Did you want to get into debate about heroes for old time's sake? No, no, no. The type of thing is in my past. And I like to focus on dishing the latest dirt. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Well, it says on ship shape, so I don't know. Hey, is Dory still here? Dory? Aw, oh, no Dory. That's too bad. Oh, hey, the Grampy Turnips here. Rooted Turnip Reef. Without wisdom, dignity, and grace, the Elder strikes a pose. This root veggie has a face and a hat that lacks all clothes. He doesn't need clothes. Where we're going, we don't need clothes. Oh yeah, we got some toads here. I was so lonely, thanks for saving me! Lots of my friends got whisked away into this world. Ominous Reef. The Gladiator's Circle, they look for advantage in a contest that turns on a dime. It's gone on for years, completely mismanaged. A battle in geological time. I'm almost wounded up from some monster's lunch on the island! Thank you! There's some crabs. Well, you know what I just realized, guys? What if one of the last islands we go to is the island that we started the game on? Wouldn't that be cool? Well, where are those ladies that are talking, though? Also, can I go talk to that toad? Out of curiosity. No, no I can. How the fuck did he get over there? Oh. Also, is there anything we can do with Grampy Turnip? Racers Reef, once rivals. These athletes together take wing. Their muscles tense as coiled steel. The greatest of racers, although this one thing, don't fall asleep at the wheel. Oh, it's the tortoise and the hare, I see. So how many have we done? You beat five Grampy Turnips. Yeah, I did that. How silly of me! Oh, you've already met at least five Grampy Turnips? Great, you must like us quite a lot! Take this! Two heart beans! Next, you need nine Grampy Turnips. So, are there any other ones that are all sand? Just all sand? Okay. Guess we're going to all sand island then. I've only met I've only met six of them, and we're almost like done the third island. Where the hell are the other ones at? I wonder. Do I need to keep talk? Wait, what do you have to say? You're preparing for the wedding on Heefree's island, right? Do you need a reminder of what you're getting from each island? Sure. Good flower and a nice cake. The artist on Floral Island. Hmm. Not a bad idea. My dears, I can't bear it. That poor little toad. The toad over there at the shop looks fine to me. No, the toad's in trouble on all sand island. Little kids do love playing in the sand. Wait, just how old are all these toads anyway? Uh, old enough to run shops. <laughs> what a puzzle! 
Well, I'm gonna make another save. Alright, well, let's go to All Sand now, because now we can actually do the toad thing. And I was also on a slip and glide. <laughs> Your friends or the strange merchant? Oh, I'm gonna do a strange merchant, because that sounds food me. Pipe, obviously. We're gonna need a patient from this island over on that place now. Oh, this is annoying though, because that means I gotta pass out a freaking sunfish again. I don't know why I keep calling them sunfish. <laughs> it's so stupid. You can't avoid them, they're, they're too fast. Alright, I'll run. You've got to be fucking shitting me. It's kind of funny to think that this game was made on Unreal Engine. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, like... Hold on. Just the, just the thought of a Mario and Luigi game being built with, like, Unreal Engine is kind of funny to me. I don't I mean, to be fair, I don't know what the other Mario and Luigi games were made with. But, you know, Unreal Engine is just, like, hella basic. Alright, so we can actually make some progress now. Hmm. I think there is something at the entrance. No! I'm not in the mood for fighting you guys. I've just come here. I've just come here to get my shit. Alright, here we go. Here's the thing that we couldn't do before. Boom. Oh, and there's the Grampy turnip. Nice job finding Grampy turnip here on All Sand Island. A fine pull, too. Difficult getting here, wasn't it? Those scary shock bones. Few visitors can reach me. I haven't spoken to anyone in ages. So I was occupying my time there with singing exercises. All Sand Island is awfully sandy. It dries out the windpipe. Singing keeps you fresh. What's a grampy turnip good for if he can't pop up and speak a word? Even your voices will get weak if you don't speak up a lot. So let me drop this wisdom on you. When lonely, sing a solo. It's fairly common to realize that you've gone most of the day without a nice chat. And you might not have anyone around to talk to for the rest of the day. That's when you've got to break out in song. Good for the throat and heart. Remember that. Just some advice from the Grampy Turnip of All Sand Island. One more thing. How is a dry throat like a pony? The answer is... They're both a little hoarse. I heard that already. Sorry. These freaking puns, bro. Yes, I got a nut. Yo, I got a mushroom, too. Alright, so here we can actually make some progress. We can go on these, like, weird cactus things. About damn time, too. I've been waiting to go up here for ages. Whoop. Gotta remember, I can press Y to let go. Whoop. Alright, and before I do that, before I talk to the Toad, let me get this last Luminade that I couldn't get before. Just two? Oh wait, hang on, there's the big ones. Dang, okay, we got like 20 there. One Hammer DX! Oh, we got even more! Three and three. Alright, so now we're at 30. Also, I think we can give Mario a good hammer, finally. Holy shit! Plus 42! That's a good hammer. Damn. <laughs> gives Luigi's a run for its money. I might give Luigi the better hammer, honestly. Yeah, that's pretty damn good. <laughs> 
All right. All right, here we go, Toad. Oh, excuse me, would you mind taking a picture of me? Here, quick, quick! Make it a cute one, okay? I think it turned out good. Wait, is that you, Mario? And Luigi? I came to this island a few days ago. I kept sinking in the sand and got chased by those shark monsters. So I got stuck here. I thought I'd never see my friends again, or return to the Mushroom Kingdom. Hello, anybody? Hey, I know that voice. Wait, there's another toad over there? It's the toad that I came here with. Mario, please help. Alright, well, let's go there then. Boom. Oh, we can actually we can actually go places now. Oh shit, he can get he can come on the land. Nope, you're not getting me. And um, can I go back to the end? Oh, actually, I can't get up from there. Ain't there a way? There ain't there a quick way to get back up there? Or nah? Whoops! <laughs> Not what I meant to do. I still don't think we're strong enough to fight these guys. Well, shit, we gotta run. Hey, that, that, those, those guys still do a fuck ton of damage. Someday I would like to try and see if I can beat those guys, though. Where is that toad at? Jesus Christ, how many enemies do you need? Fuck. Alright, if you want to die so badly, I'll give it to you. I don't need Rose Boost for this, but whatever. How badly do you guys want to die? Nah, I'm running, I don't care. Actually, I could have used the, um... Could have used the... What do you call it? Man, these guys are on my ass. Did I ever even get this? I don't remember. Mario Luigi! Yay, yeah, thanks for rescuing me! <laughs> Bro fell into the sand. I really appreciate all this. We'll head off the ship shape. Take this, I hope it helps. Can I ask for one more picture? It'll be a nice mental finding my friend. <laughs> Freaking Luigi, dude. That was actually really funny. What the fuck? <laughs> Good luck in the future, too. Yeah. All right. Um, don't know if there's anything else on this island. Oh, well, we got everything. All right, ship shape. Uh, yeah, I want to go back to ship shape so I can heal. 
And then I'm gonna go back to Hot Island or whatever the hell it's called. Just get some more Luminate and stuff from there. You remember what we need for the snack for the wedding? Yeah, I, I get it. I get it. You don't have to remind me. <laughs> I'm just I'm just uh, coming back to heal. And uh, do you have anything new? He does. Risk reward gloves. Uh, Scorching Lava, Slip and Glide Snow, and three Offens. Well, I definitely don't have three Offens, that's for sure. Okay, so we'll, uh, I guess we'll figure out what we need for that. He probably has new stuff then, doesn't he? Mm. No, he doesn't. But I can sell, um... My other pair of Forge Boots. I guess I'll sell the Excel Boots. Hmm. This one, I, I might keep these, just because why not. Don't need the Bros Hammer anymore. We can sell, um... Ooh. Restores 5% of your max HP at the end of your turn. Sell the Gold Medallion. Oh, we got a Max Mushroom. Heals 200. Those are for- I didn't- I didn't expect to find a max mushroom. Okay. Well, let's see what we need for that. So, well, we gotta go back to Scorching Island anyways. Let's see. Ooh, those are some good gloves. Increase attack and speed by 30, but you die if you take damage. Okay, let's do some fishing then. And if I can figure out where the fuck to fish. I think the fishing slot's up here. Alright, I'll buy like three, and we'll have Luigi do them. Because we respect Luigi around here. Yeah. So we gotta get one off in it. So there is a reason to do fishing then, after all. Cause I was just saying how earlier, like, um, I haven't had a reason to get materials. That's a coin fish. This one's supposed to make you equipment, so that's what I want. That's why I want to do this one. Oop. Yeah. Bruh. Another coin fish? Technically, you could just grind money because I think the coin fish should sell for more. Yeah, pretty sure. Oop. There you go, that should be it. There we go, perfect. Good thing I buy three pieces of bait then. Yeah, how? Alright. We're going back to Scorching Island, then, because we need to get some materials. And we need, um... We need to, we need to get the rest of the things there, anyway. Yeah, look at that, there's three bulbs that we missed. Missed four on this one. I mean, I mean, common. If you're, if you're using common sense, why would you ever do what that strange merchant said? I. But me, I want to do it because um, it's funny. <laughs> we are not the same. So where? Wait, where's the other bit of? Um, where are the other two bulbs? Oh. I guess we're gonna go over this lava though. Oh yeah, there's like an entire part of this island that we never went to yet. Also, there's just random money down here. 
Yeah, we never ever, we never came in here. Okay, well. Let me uh, go over here first. Super syrup. See, now we're getting slightly better items. Super mushroom. Boing. Come on, Linguini. You gotta get them. So, oh, that's all of them. Wait, so why did I say there was three of them on this island, then? Maybe there's one more in, in like, a cave or something, then. That might be it. Um, I'm gonna save up for the 60s one. Actually, speaking of which, let me see what plugs I have. I need to set a new one. Boomerang is all, or the coin one is already charged up. Yeah, let's do coin plier. There we go. And we can throw on the the boomerang items, I suppose. So what's in here then? There's just a random ass cave here that we've never been to. What the hell is this? This is completely optional, if I'm not mistaken, so... Yeah, what the hell. Okay. Guess we're not first striking these guys. Alright, let's see. Luigi got the power up. Let's see how much these, this damage... Let's see how much damage you can do with this. Yeah. Ooh, 758, a new record. And it's out of charge. Rip. Well, we got a new record on damage. Yoshi, that one wasn't me. <laughs> the Yoshi perp. Alright, so which way should we go? Uh, over here. Uh, for a super syrup. Wait, hang on. Yeah, super mushroom. There's some, some pretty definitely not suspicious hidden blocks or anything. Black gang! So this counts as being a Gloam enemy and a Bowser enemy at the same time, doesn't it? Kinda neat. Finally, Mario has a good AoE move, too. <laughs> and now he has Bomb Derby. That one came out too slow. See, I'm trying to do these counters like, legitimately. <laughs> but it comes out so damn fast that I'm starting to think that maybe I should just, um... You know, I should just press both buttons. Man, we're getting the dough. We're getting all the dough. 242. Yeah, I love coin. I'm a love coin player. That's like one of my new favorite ones now. It just, it just gives you so much money. How are we doing? I, we, we, we don't need to heal yet. Yeah, look at all that money. The coin noises are pretty nice in this game. Bruh. <laughs> oh, it's just the one guy? Okay. I can deal with the one guy. Still haven't fucked up the bros moves yet. 
Yeah. Man, we just does so much damage now. Pretty damn good. Um, let's heal up Luigi's BP. There we go. Yeet. There's a big boy right there. Now I can afford it. Alright, let's get, um... Hmm. Back at you, attack. Um... Is that our deluxe auto? Let's get deluxe auto, actually. <laughs> Finished. I could get auto one up just to unlock some more earlier. Boom. Is there gonna be one of those bomb buzz here? Hey, there we go. I finally first struck you, you ass wipe. Boom. Wake up, bitch. Boom. I got so many damn games to play and finish. November is a good month. <laughs> it's a good month, man, I tell ya. There's so much shit to play. Um, what else do I do here? That's not the exit, so let's go over here. Is there another hidden block? Super nut! Man, I'm loving, I'm loving this cave song, man. It, 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 I'm starting to recognize it now. It's like, hey, it's the cave theme! 13. Alright, gotta go fast. Gotta get over there quick. There we go. Alright, what's, what's in here that's so important? Max candy! I'm so excited, I can't even talk. Restores HP and BP 100%. That's our first max candy this game. Neato. Okay, so we can't push that boulder out of the way, so what else is here? Um, yeah, there's like this entire part of this island that we've never been to before. Ooh, some beans. Oh, I have a lot of beans that I never used. Alright, definitely give the bros beans to Luigi so they're evened out. <laughs> and keep Luigi quick. Whoops. Whoops. Okay, again. <laughs> Give me all that money. Give me your money! Eighty-two, huh? Yeah, so that just gave me a hundred. Hundred coins. Fifty coins. Hang on, I can't even get up there. Is there like some new ability that I don't know about? Maybe I'm supposed to use the bomb on that boulder or something? Let's see. Oh, yeah. oh let's, let's try it. I don't think it does anything. What the hell is this thing doing in the way then? I don't know. I guess we might have to come back here later. Okay, well, at least I got that done. I don't even know if I got any Scorching parts. Maybe I should throw on the loot booster. <laughs> Come back there later or something. I, I don't fucking know. <laughs> but we gotta come back here and get some stuff, too. Actually, yeah, I can check... You dumbass, get up! Oh, oops. 
Um, so, Stylo said they got an unusual dessert ingredient here on Slip and Glide. They use it to make Snowco butter cake. Oh, yeah. oh, man, since I'm here, I might as well do that. Um... <laughs> Fear of Gloam. I mean, we gotta come here anyways for a quest. And there's a toad here. There's like three things here, bro. Yeah, I did not get any scorching lava at all. Boo. Lame. No drops, man. Well, where are they at? Oh, there's like two things here. Is there anything up here, by the way? Oh yeah, I just straight up never went up here. What the fuck? Oh hey, it's one of these. We haven't done these in a while. Oops, wrong button. I, I pressed I pressed A instinctively. Boom. I know, really riveting gameplay here. Super Mushroom, Super Syrup, 1-Up, Bear Gloves, wow, cool, yes, I score 27, hey, maybe I can try, try and get 100 again. At the very least, I beat my high score. I feel like it's getting faster. Oh, it's definitely getting faster. Ah, 66? Not even the funny number? Dang. Hey, I got a mushroom, though, <laughs> for my efforts. A 1-up. A stash bean DX? Hey, I, I got something for that. Cool. Uh, I'm sure Mario gonna have that. And Luigi gonna have that. That wasn't bad. i say that was worth it. He has something for a hundred, apparently. I don't know, though. Can't be arsed, honestly. Oh, hello, Mario Luigi. Are you here for the cake? Huh? You're worried about us? Oh, we're fine. We're just taking a little strategy here. Want to hear our new tactics catchy name? It's called Operation Too Stubborn to Fail. Forget about the gloam. We're talking about the Chief's son wedding here. He has to listen. We'll use the powers of passionate persuasion to get the old man to the wedding. It'll be, it'll work. So no need to worry or check up on us. Everything will be fine. Connie and Ark are gonna go to Slip and Slide, Slip and Slide, Slip and Glide Island in preparation for Bernadette and Chilliam's wedding. This one's a, this one's got limited time too. Okay, so it's a little bit further up ahead then. So many people here with frickin' gloam infections. My son? Yes, I think I did have a son once, now that you mention it. How can you be so cold? Prince Chilliam's getting married, Chief. Chilliam? Yes, I remember him. He's one of the main people who tended to make a fool of me. My son, the villagers, everyone, they despise me in their hearts. I couldn't give one single shit about my son's wedding.
Oh. Holy shit. Connie, how can we have a wedding? This is the horrible power of Gloam. Well, just bring the dock over and force feed him shit. No one wants to talk to anyone else. Or even make eye contact. Or celebrate with their kids. It just breaks my heart. Ark, do you think we'll ever recover from this? Of course we will. It'll all work out. I hope. Mario, Luigi, the chief and everyone else, are they beyond help? No. <laughs> Press A to talk. <laughs> you think that inside gentle hearts, there can be strength? Oh, yeah. Yes! Press A to give motivation! And you believe that I'll make it, come what may? Yeah. I'm always cheerful. <laughs> and I keep everyone's spirits up? Oh, yeah! You say that's the arc you know? Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Mario, Luigi, thank you. So we need to push that all, all- we need to push past all that negativity. We need to do what we can here and now. Hey, you know what? I wanted to tell you, I heard something interesting when I got off the s- when I got swept off to the Great Lighthouse Island. <clears throat> Collect more negative energy. Spur on the revival. Oh, that's- that's him. Gather more negative energy. <laughs> It's that thing again. I don't really want to think about it, but I get the sense that something even worse will... Collecting negative energy? What in Concordia could... We can't let ourselves become more distant from each other. This wedding will be a success, and everyone will live in harmony. I'm gonna go talk to the chief one more time. I think we got this, guys. You take care of the wedding preparations for us, okay? Too fast, gloves. Alright, let hang on. Now that I'm here, I can break these boxes. Get some free items. Uh, also, one thing I didn't do was, uh, go across this. Wait, hang on, there's a- I forgot about the toad over here. <laughs> it's no good, I'm getting sleepy! Oh, what a beautiful winged angel! Come to take me to Great Beyond! A big pig like for an angel, but whatever. Hey, shut up! Ah, uh, Mario! Mario! Ah! Uh, wow, Luigi! See, a mysterious force blasted us to this island. There's me and two other toads. They're around here somewhere. We kind of got split up. You know what? You know what I just realized, guys? This is like the fucking spiritual successor to the toad missions in Paper Jam. Oh no. Oh no. Why did I bring that up? You look for my toad buddies? You're the best. One went into some caves to get some sleep. The other went looking for something to eat. You need to get them before they're frozen solid. On the bright side, though, these aren't forced, and two, you actually get some decent rewards from them. So, it all works out, I think. Okay, so... 
Hey buddy, how's it going? They open, they close. That's the way of it. You need to blast through snip snap when they're closed. Huh? You're, you, say, you say you're comfortable with that? Charging through like a runaway snowball? Unless you like bowl through like plow. And you best leave it well alone, I say. Oh, so I couldn't have done this last time anyways. Whoops! Hang on, I got this. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. There we go. Bruh. Alright, there's one. All that for an ultra shroom. Hey, I got an idea. Yeah, I can make a shortcut over here. Alright, so we jump over here. Okay, so I've been here already, but my question is, how do I get over there? Do I need to go over here? How the fuck do I get up there? Oh! Am I dumb? Oh, wait, there's a pipe there. Now. Oh, there's like a shortcut over there now. Okay. That makes a lot of sense now. Yeah, we got we got like some shortcuts back over there. Did I ever go up here by the way? Fishy Boopkins is here. Again. Alright, time to murder the shit out of Fishy Boopkins, guys. Yeah. Boom. 626. Man, my damage just keeps getting better and better. Yeah, we haven't done the red shell in a while. Let's do that. Just for good old time's sake. Boom. Ooh. Still pretty decent damage. Hey, Mario's level 27! Lucky! Damn, 6 power! That's crazy, man. The, 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 these power stat upgrades are kind of insane. I guess they kind of need to be, because there's not that many beans in this game. Whoops, I <laughs> did the same mistake again. I will definitely kill the Gloam enemy first. There's actually not a lot of Gloam ice adds on this island. I think there's like a couple and that's about it. I think the drill, I think, I think Luigi's only able to deal damage on spiky enemies when you get the, uh, full action command. Oh yeah, let's put another, um, let's put another thing on. Could put on, well, the anti-flying specialist won't happen. Yeah, put on performance bonus again, why not? Also, let's see what happens when I use a super ultra syrup jar on Luigi. Hey, yeah, okay, that's sick. And I got a lucky from a frickin' counterattack, dude, that's sick. Also, I love the frickin' northern lights. The northern lights in the background is really frickin' cool. This might be one of the nicest looking snow areas in a Mario & Luigi game, honestly. Oh, yeah. Which is saying a lot, because they're in a lot of- they're in- they're in like, half of them. <laughs> half the Mario & Luigi games have a snow level. I don't think I ever came down here. So this is brand new, I'm pretty sure. 
Alright, jump helmet. Wait, so in theory, I could have infinite max candies. Because I could just use a max candy in battle, have boomerang item, and then I just get my max candy back. That's fucking OP, actually. What the hell? So all I need is one of each item, and I could just have infinite of them, technically. Wow. That's actually I, that's actually kind of insane. Well, and since that since putting on plugs don't cost a turn, I could literally just have infinite BP whenever I want. I could just say like, oh, I want I want a max candy. I want to use a max candy. Just put on the item boomerang plug. Get a free item back. I have to. I'll have to test and see if that actually works. Also, I don't think we've been in here this part of the island. Now the connector flowers have opened up, you can get to the other side. Yeah, they got some kind of research place over there. Surely ice cream research. They spend their whole time doing serious ice cream research. I can't wait to visit. Hey you, have you heard? This cake maker is the pride of Slip and Glide Island. Snow Cold Butter, it's a funny name for sure, but the taste is something else. You gotta try it. Are you familiar with the pink flowers here? Step on one, but not- Step on one to put a spring on your step. I think they're rather fetching myself. They get buried under snow in no time here, though. If only I had a vacuum cleaner, I'd suck up all the snow. Oh. That's how you do it. Also, is that one of the toes that we need to rescue? Oh, but damn, we just got, like, 30. Oh. Well, I'm sorry! Mario and Luigi! I heard the cake here was really good. I might have had taken a teasy little taste. My toad buddy's looking for me! I was maybe going to uh, sample some more cake, but... No, no, I understand. Time to get going. I'll be waiting with the other toad. Where is the other toad, actually? That little mushroomy kid from earlier snaffled my cake, I just know it. The mushroom smell's gone. Just regular old cakey smells now. Dang, that's a lot of frickin' bulbs. Man, man, we can we can fuse some shit now. Dude, they're just handing out free illuminate at this point. This is actually crazy. Please, you go get that other one. Or I'll get it. Holy shit, I have 118 now. That's the most I've ever had. Okay, let's do um not dropping. And, um, I guess we'll do auto, well, auto excellent is boring. I'll do auto one-up. Okay, so what do we have? We have second helping. When using an item, uses two identical items of your inventory to give the benefit for both. How does that work? So it just uses double? Countdown to cure. The number of charges decreases at the end, on every of every turn. When the number reaches zero, HP and BP are 100% restored. Ooh, interesting. Countdown to charge. The number of charges decrease at the end of every turn. When it reaches zero, all other equipped plugs are recharged by 50%. That's a good one. And when another equipped plug would lose charges, this plug's charge decreases instead. Man, these are some good ass plugs. Holy shit. And, um. Wait, craft five more. Oh, yeah, right, because I haven't done these other ones yet. Those are some damn good ones, I gotta say. So we only have to make nine more to unlock this last one. I don't know what this last one is, but it has to be freaking good. Well, how many more are there? There's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we actually don't need to craft all of them to make the final one. 
But there probably is enough Luminate to make every single one, if I had to guess. Still don't know why there's two copies of the Kaboom Attack and Iron Ball, though. That's very weird. Maybe if you combine both of them, it makes like a bigger ball, Iron Ball or something. That could be possible, actually. Yeah, he doesn't tell me where the other Toad is. Maybe if I go talk to him, he'll tell me. Okay. Whoops. So that's how you get that. That's how you get this block, then. I get a super candy. Neato. Hey, look in your eye. You're searching for a snow coat butter wedding cake. With the right ingredients, I can make one, but I don't have everything I need. Ah, oh, fuck. Yep, I'm missing some delightful sugared powder for the white chocolate. Sugared powder from Mount, S Mount Sweet Tooth in the northwest part of this town, yep. You'll get some from me? If you could bring me back some of that sugared powder, I'll make the best snow coat butter wedding cake you ever tasted, yep. Oh boy, I got some fetch quests now. <laughs> well... Luckily, there is a, um... Well, is that, is that the is that where the cake is? Up there? Yeah. We did make a pipe shortcut. Hmm. Well, actually, now that I think about it... Hmm. Is there nothing over here? Just checking. Also, I missed this, somehow. Yeah. Somehow missed that block. Is there any snow snowco butter here? I could have sworn there was some up here. Well, this is technically not the northwest part of town. This is the northeast part of town. I was just checking. I get I did get that item, so I guess it's all plan it all balances out. So where'd that other toad go then? Um he's not here, I can tell you that. Hey, where's the other toad at? The toad's still out there, went looking for a place to sleep in some caves. I wonder if he's just sleeping on a bed of ice or something. Oh, I gotta go into that frickin' cave again? Hmm. Oh wait, I marked it on the on the map where I need to go. Um Okay, I guess we'll go down here then. We can even jump while you're doing that. That's pretty sick. Well, it's a good thing I accepted that quest, you know. Because now I have two things to do while I'm here. This isn't where it is. Man, you go so fast in the ball now. This might be, like, the ideal way to move around the world. Maybe. Hey, look at that. Another lucky. Perfect. Yeah, I can really feel I'm getting more luckies now. <laughs> Wait, hang on a second. Do I have Kaboom Attack? Let's throw that on for a sec. Oh. Dang it, it didn't kill the fishy boopkins. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be funny. LOL, he died! Oh, yeah. He frickin' died, bro, from his own shit. What a dumbass. Yeet, I'm out of here. 
But I guess there's a reason to go back up here after all. Boom. Alright, so where's that snow cold water at? At the top of this mountain? Boom. Ah, oh, that stuff. Sugar powder. The best wedding cakes are made with this stuff. Yeah! Mario- it literally just looks like Mario summoned the PNG, bro. I summoned the PNG! Well, because PNGs look kind of out of place in an all-3D world now, don't they? Likewise, I think it's even funnier when you're playing an all-2D game, and then randomly a 3D object just spawns out of nowhere. Also, there's nothing here. Oh shit. <laughs> Bro almost got me. Okay, well we gotta go in those caves then, I guess. I want it. Well, where this item is. Max Syrup Jar. Alright, what do we got? We have enemies! I think we'll get this toad quest done, and then we'll probably call it a day. Dang, okay. Dang, Luigi got fucked up, bro. Sure, bully Luigi, will you? <laughs> I get. I mean, is it even the year of Luigi anymore? <laughs> oh no, my money! You gotta be fucking kidding me, bro. Why you gotta bully Luigi, dude? What did Luigi ever do to you, man? Uh, boomerang item. Thanks, boomerang item. There we go. You guys have like three different attacks. Alright, I guess we'll be using the zappy zap again. I have been using the green shell much just because it's not that great anymore. That's just the sad thing about any bros attack, is they become outclassed. But, sadly, it is what it is. Alright, so I kinda got rocked there. Let's use, uh... Let's use, uh... Oh, you know what? Let's use a candy... Let's use some candies on Luigi. There we go. And I guess a mushroom on Mario. Yeah, regular syrup. That was not a regular syrup, but you know what I mean. I'm gonna get this moon knee real quick. Hmm? Have I ever been? Oh, that's uh, that's from later in the game. That's when I leave the cave. So we gotta go back into the cave and find that Todd. Where's that Todd at? Oh, hell no! Not dealing with that. Hell no! Hell no! I guess we- I guess we aren't learning the fire and ice move. Alright, where is Todd? Oh, he's somewhere in this maze. Hello, Todd, where are you at? Oh, he's up there. A yeah, good re a good reason you reuse this puzzle, then I'd say. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. All right, Linguini, it's time. I really like these puzzles anyway. 
They're fun. Um, I think I can just get over there by doing this. Mario! You came to save me! <laughs> I was looking for a warm place to sleep, but I ended up here. Ooh, okay, let's go. And then Luigi was never seen again. Thanks a lot! This little toad's party is gonna head over to Ship Shape Island! Hi Luigi, keep doing your hero stuff. We got your back. Well, I mean that's all the that's all the toad colors, so I think we'll be good on toad missions for a while. Okay. Now we can head back. Thankfully this teleporter is back here, so now we can make a quick trip over to the the cake shop. And we can finish our business on this island. I might do some grinding for the scorching stuff off screen. That's sugar powder. Yes, thank you for finding it. I can make some world class soap cold butter cake with this. I'll mix in some snow, a dash of diamond dust. Okay, we'll leave the details to you. Just make sure you whip up a nice, royally good wedding cake. Of course. I'll ship my masterpiece to the wedding venue when it's ready. Yep. The wedding cake preparation is complete. Alright, next up, the flower crown. I mean, it was either that or I could buy one from... Oh, what if I what if I do, like, a bit of mixing and matching? We got a rainforest island. We could do that. Alright, I forgot this takes me back to the entrance. Wrong pipe. Thanks for cool. Well, it depends what I need to do on Rainforest Island, right? I don't know. You know what? I feel like making this a longer one. Let's do- let's go to Rainforest, then. We'll see what we can do here. Do, do, do. What? Now that fly I said flower crowns made from wooly blooms are hot now. They grow in rainforest. Let's see if we can find ourselves a few. Wooly blooms? Where is that at? Um, up there, okay. I don't think there's really a whole lot that we can do here that we haven't done already. I mean, there's the funny lizards and all that. Those lasers are pretty, they're pretty random and shitty now. They don't give any experience. You gotta be fucking kidding me, bro. Why would I want to fight you losers from long ago? Wait, ha 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 ha, hold up. You outspeed me? Are you kidding me? Or is it because I got first struck? It might be because I got first struck. But still, that, that's a that's a load of bullshit. That's bullshit. <laughs> As the EVGN says. Well, actually, it's not the EVGN, it's the bullshit, man. Bro, I came here for nothing. There was nothing over here. Fuck. I'm wasting my time. Don't you dare. No, you, no, you don't! No, you don't! I think he's dead anyway. Boom. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, yeah! We had our first one of those where I jump on an enemy and they all die. Hmm. Wait, I just thought of something. There's something I need to test. Give me a sec. Where is the nearest lizard? I need to test something. Let me see something.
Oh shit, that actually counts. That counts towards that. Oh crap, maybe I should be killing some enemies then. I can get that challenge done while I'm backtracking the old ass islands. Yeah, sure. Hang on, let's get some extra money while we're here. Um, it's still quite a while, still quite a ways away. So, how do I get? Man, it takes so long to get there. I should have taken the pipe. Jeez, I didn't know I had to go all the way up there. Well, hey, on the bright side, we can get started on that 300 challenge. The reason why I didn't want to do it is because I have to re-equip my, like, equipment. That's kind of annoying. Oh, yeah. But I think I'm taking that out of proportion. <laughs> if you can't dodge, use the emergency guard. I did it for fun. Oh, yeah. Boom. Huh. Yeah, let's do this oh, again. Oh, yeah. I like those red and green. I love those M and L coins. They're pretty cool. Oh, yeah. yeah. So what I was thinking is I'd go back to like some really old ass islands, like this one and uh, Rumbla Island, and I just like kill a shit ton of easy enemies, and then we can just get like that challenge. Like, you know, kind of over with quicker. Oh, yeah! I mean, on average, I'd probably have to kill like a hundred enemies to do it. Stomp on a hundred enemies, because each one has like, you know, two to four different enemies per loadout. So it would take a second to do, but it's not bad. Ugh. <sighs> God damn it, dude. Get out of here, man. I, I don't have time for your shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Boom. Oh, yeah. I mean, for backtracking, it's not too bad to do that stuff. But you're really not doing that much damage because of it. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah, right. I kind of forgot about the whole block situation here. Yeah. Any other enemies I can kill for free? I think in order to get back up there, I gotta hit that switch again. Die. I think so, right? I think I need to hit this. Yeah, we're having a longer episode of Brothership today. Oh wait, no, yeah, I can't do that. Man, I'm dumb, I can't even remember this frickin' puzzle, bro. That's how you know I've been going on long enough. Can I actually question? Can I roll under there with the ball ability? No. Okay. Never mind, I guess. Hmm. How the fuck do I get up there again? I forgot. This is why it would have been easier if I took the pipe. <laughs> oh, wait. I think I just supposed to hit this. Yeah, I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm trying- I'm trying to rush things. Okay, so it says it's like to the left here. Gotcha, bitch. Lol, he gone. Okay, should I put my gear back on for this? Maybe just to be safe. 
Wait, I had the on guard boots on Mario, didn't I? Yeah. Um. Yeah, put that on Mario. See, that's exactly why I didn't want to take this shit off. <laughs> okay, um. What's the two fast gloves? Boosts speed and stash by 20%, but reduces max BP by 20%. Not bad, not bad, honestly. First contact, ready already. Boost speed in proportion to the number of plugs you have. <laughs> Man, I could do that. Well, what else did I want to put on? Yep, you know, put on the two fast gloves for shits and giggles. Perfect. At the very least, I want to see what we can do here on Rainforest. So let's see what, what's so special about being over here. Oh, stop! What are you doing to the world blooms? <laughs> yeah, that ought to do it. I rule. The flower garden's all messed up. How sad for you. <laughs> Why would you do that? Why? I thought it was obvious. Because it's annoying. Want to hold a wedding? Connect an island? I'm here to stop you. Whatever you do, count me. Count on me getting in the way. All right, I said my piece. Time for me to scram. You chumps aren't good enough to fight me, though the, these are more your speed. Oh, hey, we got some enemies to kill. Nice. Alright, well, let's zap them then. Cause that's what we do best. Boom. I was curious to see what happens if you, um, you know, follow what the funny merchant guy says. And as it turns out, he sends enemies and he ruins an entire garden. That's pretty great. Um, we, we haven't done Empower Counters in a while, let's throw that on. Get out of here! Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here indeed. Oh, I got a rainforest oh, yeah. vine for that too. Thanks for saving us. Too bad about all the world of blooms. Although, come to think of it, hey, yeah. I've heard there's a blue Reflexia no one's ever seen before someone on this island. It's supposed to be a unique and beautiful flower. If you can find it, I bet it would make for a lovely flower crown. Bring one to me and I'll make it. Sounds like a plan. Let's go get that blue Reflexia. Well, where is that, then? That's over there, apparently. Have, you even, have I even been to this part of the island before? Oh my god, no, I haven't. You, yeah, we, we can go up here now. I, never, I wasn't even able to go over here before. When the fuck did this part of the island open up exactly? I don't know. Weird. Oh, yeah. Come on, Luigi. We don't got time. We don't got all day. 
Oh, now Luigi decides to have a hitbox for getting into battles? That's so dumb, bro. I suppose this will add to my, um... This will add to my enemy count- my enemy counter list. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say. Okay, so how do I- how do I get up there, then? That's a good question, Mega Man. Yeah, how the fuck do I get up there? Is there a switch over here? Oh, there's some flowers. Wait, there's another thing back here. Okay, cool, cool. We get to do like a little platforming puzzle. Neat. Well, hang on, I see something over there. Yeah, I just straight up never been to this part of the island before. That's weird. I find that pretty shocking, honestly. I'm gonna try and avoid those stupid freaking parachute guys. Because <laughs> they're so weak now. Oh, we get another one of these fun platforming sections. You definitely do not want to fall here. That's just bad news. Yeah. Love that noise. Is that it? But there's plant gangs here. Yeah. Wow, who would have guessed I'd have to fight some plant gangs, too? On top of those Zok guys. <laughs> well, isn't this exciting? Level 26 Brana Plants. Love, love the enemy variety now. <laughs> You just have, like, random Concordia enemies, you have Zoc Troopers, and then you have Bowser's Minions, you know, that's just fun. Boom, get out of here. Mario is very close to a level up. Yeesh, those things almost ate me for breakfast. Hey, breakfast is good. Think the goons leave on a scorching put him here? Mario. There's that blue flower. This it, the blue or flesh here. You got the blue or flesh here. Yeah, that is very beautiful looking. You found it! A blue reflexia! This changes everything. My mind is a fertile garden of new ideas. With Blossom this special, I can make you the ultimate flower crown. Yahoo! The wedding cake and flower crown are all set. Now the wedding ceremony can happen. Woohoo! Just in time for the wedding. We should get ourselves to heat freeze. Yeah, which we will probably do in the next episode. A big debate. Listen in on the group conversation. Okay, maybe we should do those too. Or we should do that in, well, nah, let's do that in the next episode. This episode's gone on long enough, I think. <laughs> Three hours? You guys get a longer bonus episode, because uh, I fucked around in that cave for a little too long. And uh, there's a lot of faffing at the start, so I feel like a longer episode is, you know, worth the- it's worth it. Cake check, flower crown check. Our part of the ceremony's ready. Time to get to Heat Freeze Island. So, 
what what part of the what a part of this island do I need to go to? Hmm. Where are the girls that want to debate? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to look for. Is it you? Is it you two? That's what I'm, I'm confused about. That honestly, it says, well. Yeah, it says, on Ship Shape Island, there's a group conversation. That's what I'm confused about. I'll find them, give me a sec. Are the women there talking about them? I think someone might hear us. Let's chat at the beach. That that might be the that might be the, the chatting women they're talking about. <laughs> let's go let's go do that. Oh yeah, peach here. There's a lot to talk about. The gossip girls. Were you listening? No. This is a top secret discussion. Anyone not involved in the debate should leave. Do not get close and listen in. It's a breach of etiquette and it's not cool. And and you were chased away from a set- a secret of group discussion. You're not supposed to listen in, but... I just like... Red or green, I can't decide. Oh, we can eat him. Should we listen? Yes. If you're asking me which is more stylish, I definitely can't decide. I guess pink's my favorite. I mean, red and green are both cute. But I like anything if it's in pink. Oh, you're wearing pink now. You match Princess Peach. Ha, <laughs> yeah, that's a bonus. Really, anything other than pink just doesn't work for me. I definitely... It, it definitely makes you feel good when you can get to match with someone to look up to. I get it. How about you, Tech Nikki? You seem like you have a unique, interesting take on fashion. Oh, I don't know. A plain white coat works just fine for me. I don't need anything too fancy. I want durability. Something that stands up to lab work. Heat and cold resistance are good. It needs to offer freedom of movement and toughness to hold up after multiple washings. What else do I need? I can appreciate how wonderful that white coat is, but... Would you ever think about wearing something super trendy? Yeah, variety is kinda nice, and a long dress would look great on you. Oh, if you're talking about long dresses, talk to us! That's our favorite attire! Dresses? I thought those were towels. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You look great. What do you think, Tech Nikki? Well, let me think. I suppose I could try something new. Perhaps something black. For the sake of scientific research, of course. Haha, <laughs> sure. Scientific research. Speaking of which, Starlow, what's your story? Do you even need clothes? Rude. You can clearly see that I wear shoes, can't you? Well, I mean, you're a beautiful shade of yellow, that's all. But we might need to adjust our definition of the word clothing. Let's say that shoes are clothes. And I guess you don't have much laundry, so I see the logical value. Well, this appearance is only temporarily, you know. I'm actually an eight-headed beauty. What? I need to know more. But first, what kind of clothing does Connie like? Her ensemble with the cap. It's a nice balanced combo. Some might consider her quite the fashionista. Is that the term? Maybe we'll ask her in secret sometime. But what about the rest of you? When the fuck did Birdo get here? As long as I've got the deep red ribbon, I've got no complaints. Unnecessary accessories are out. Doesn't everyone else think so? Agree, that ribbon is cute. And finally, what about our dear Princess Peach? What do you think? Any styles you secretly want to try out? I'm interested, for scientific purposes. Well, I... It's hard to go wrong with a pink dress and a crown. But I do like to change things up to match the task at hand, you know? Is that a, is that a frickin' Princess Peach Showtime reference? You might not know me well enough to see it, but I do have many outfits. 
Okay, enough chit chat. Dang, the whole girl gang's here. I am so interested in the kinds of fashion adventures Peach gets up to. <laughs> We've got work to do. Idol group, let's go. Right, Princess Peach? Wow, you really are good at changing the subject. Oh, yeah! Hey! Were you listening to us? Not cool, guys. Let's go, people. <laughs> Girl squad out. Mario, Luigi, Snoutlet. I thought we told you not to listen in on our chat. Regardless, we got you something. Our chat became a conversational fashion. Next time, all of us should talk about the kinds of styles you guys like. Heh, <laughs> that'd be fun. Take care now. Got a rose bean. I, th I thought she was gonna be just like a, like a piece of overalls or something. Okay. Oh well. Anyways, um, let's use that rose bean. Oh yeah, Luigi has like no BP now because I put that freaking those freaking gloves on him. Okay, last thing. I'm gonna say I'm gonna heal, and then we're gonna save. I just wanted to get that done with because it was gonna bother me otherwise. I think besides the frickin', um, fr besides the frickin' scorching lava shit that I need, we are basically done. But, uh, that's something I can do off-screen. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching Brothership. Make sure to like and subscribe to on YouTube and Twitch. Um, Mario might- or not Mario, but Luigi actually might get to level 28 off-screen. I am gonna do a bit of off-screen stuff. Like, it's nothing important, just some- just some material farming, maybe getting a head start on that challenge where I gotta kill 300 enemies. You know, typical shit. But anyways, um, I'll see you guys in the next episode where I guess we're gonna do the wedding, because that's apparently part of the story now. <laughs> it's like a filler episode in an anime. Anyways, I'll see you guys then.